Hello, so the talk of the Discord right now is how difficult today's Not Wordle is, today being December 23rd. Now, Not Wordle might be the most complicated of the Wordle variants that I've played, and I haven't played it very much. Um, so we'll see how I do here, especially still being sick. But what if I pull up the help, it's it's a little bit better, but it's still quite confusing. So basically for every guess, we're getting a lot of different clues all at once about the guess but they're all not super useful on their own. So let's go over each one. The first is this, this, so you type your guess just like in Wordle, and then over here is all the clues for it. So the first thing is just the Scrabble score. So on our keyboard here, you'll see the Scrabble value of each letter. It just adds those up for you and tells you the Scrabble score. You're gonna need that because the next clue is whether your Scrabble score is too high, too low, or equal. So, um, to the answer. So you can use the Scrabble score as kind of a hint towards uh, which letters might be in the word. Um, and then the second is just if you were to alphabetically list your word against the other word, do we need to go towards A or towards Z? So for where, we need to go towards A, which means we need to guess a word that's before where. It could still start with W-H-E, right? But then we'd have to be before the R, or it could even be W-H-E-R-A, right? And that's still before where. Um, the next is a clue that I very rarely use because I have no idea how it gets this info, but well, I guess it's based on Google Books and Gram dataset. But anyway, it's whether the word that the answer is more, uh, more common or less common than what we guessed. So where is too common and pills is too obscure. Not the, e not the easiest clue to use, but it could help. The next clue is uh, a word ladder distance. So if you played Weaver, you're familiar with word ladders where you change one letter at a time in the word to make another word um, and then you need to go from one word to the, the answer. So from where to the answer, changing one letter at a time while still being a valid word, um, we are five away, whereas vague is 11 away. And sometimes there is no possible word ladder, in which case it'll just tell you that. And then finally, we have our wordle color counts, but Greens take priority over yellows, which take priority over grays. So where has two greens in it. It could have any number of yellows between zero and three. Pills has one yellow in it, which means we know there are no greens in pills, but there's one yellow. And then vague is all gray. So um, that is how you play. I hope that wasn't too tedious. I know that this game can be extremely complicated to understand, so I wanted to go over it in detail because I don't do it on my channel very often. So I have no idea what a good starting word is for not Wordle. Um, so why don't I use my symbol start of Blaze and see what happens there? <laughs> it has a very high Scrabble score because of the Z, so maybe not the bet. Maybe I'll do something like hmm, I'll, I'll change up blaze to blade. Eight is a fairly neutral Scrabble score. Let's just see what happens with blade and go from there. Starting with B is probably bad though, because uh, we do need to go towards Z. Uh, we have one green in blade. We don't know how many yellows there are. The word ladder is nine away, which means it's not very similar to blade. Um, so our score is too low and we need to go towards Z. So maybe what I'll do is I'll change the B to something more in middle alphabet, so like G. Let, let's assume the E is in place at the end, and let's just do entirely new letters. So let's do mouse. The M is very neutral. Uh, oh, but our score is too low for mouse. Do we care? We may not care at this point. I think I'm going to use the other clues first. And let's see if mouse ends up with a green, although it could be that some other letters in mouse end up green, but let's see. So we know the score is too low. We have to go towards A. That's good to know. We're between B and A for the starting letter. We're still too common. And our word ladder is 8, and we still have one green. So it could be the E, um, but we're running out of other letters if E is the only green. I, I like to fish out the alpha, around where in the alphabet it is, as well as the Scrabble score. I think those are the most useful clues at first. Not that I've played this game very much, so it could be a bad strategy, but let's try something between B and M. Maybe G or H or something. So we could continue to end in E. How would I do that? I'm thinking about just doing alphabetical and Scrabble score. 
Um, glory brings us to nine. That's not great. Glove. I kind of like glove. It's still nine, but let, let's just see what that does to the score. Score is still too low. Still one green. All right, we got to do a higher score. Um, go towards A. So between B and G, there aren't that many letters between B and G. Maybe, maybe I want to do something like starting with E or maybe starting with C because C is a th is already score of three, so that's helpful. Um, F would be better though, right? Because F is four. It's hard to be between B and G though. Like um, we have. C D E F are the C D E F are the only letters. So D or E would technically be better to fish out our starting letter, but they're also low in score, and we need a high score here. So we still don't know if that E is green. By the way, it, it, it's, it's looking less and less likely for the E to be green, as that would mean that we don't have any of the other letters. Although we could have the other letters; they're just yellow. So let's see what we can do here. Um, should we get like an X or a Q or a Z in here? Ooh, what about something like equal? That's a score 14. I am curious what happens with equal. Um, we'll, we'll just go from there. It's fine. Score is too high with equal. We do not have a green anymore, but we do have a yellow. And there is no word ladder, which is not surprising with the word like equal. So go towards Z. So if we start with E, then we have to be E and then something after Q. So probably we start with F or we start with G, but we do like G and then something before L. So let's just start with F. And then the, the Scrabble score is finally too high. So we're somewhere between 9 and 14. So we're 10 to 13. Um, with something like Flame. Flame is 10. That's pretty good. That has some good stuff. Let's do Flame. I know it can't be. Otherwise, Glove would have two greens. Hmm. How about Frame instead, then? That's still 10. It doesn't work for Blade, though. Blade would have two greens also. I think Froze is going to be way too high. Yeah, so we don't... Um, I, I, I need to just keep guessing stuff, or this is going to take forever. So I'm just going to do Frame. And I, I'd like to at least fish out our um, Scrabble score and our Alphabet. Score is too low at 10. We have three greens in frame. I mean, just go towards A. So I think we start with F. I think we might end in E. Uh, do we? What if it was F, R, A, and then just like Frank or something? Because no, Frank is, uh, Frank is not towards A. Uh, we need to do it before M. Maybe something like Fray oh it can't be frail. Well that's too low anyway. Um We're somewhere we're eleven, twelve, or thirteen points. FRA is six, so I need another five, six, or seven points. What would be the green and mouse here? It would have to be the S, right? And then the green and glove. Maybe we do start with E. No, we can't start with E, because equal would have a green. So we do start with F. We 100% start with F. We don't have to do FR. If we did FL, then that would be green for blade and glove. And then we need a green from mouse. Okay, FL makes a lot of sense. That would also be the yellow and equal. So we couldn't do a U, we couldn't do an A, we couldn't do an O. An E would make sense. Is flesh good? Flesh is 11 points. Flesh has a green and mouse. I like it. Let's do it. Oh, it's not flesh. Not even close. Oh, I didn't get three greens from frame when I tried flesh. But we do have more info. Um, I don't know why I didn't look at frame, of all things, to, to figure out that. Um, I was so confident about flesh for some reason. Okay, so we need to go towards A more. Our Scrabble score needs to be 12 or 13. We've been guessing words that are far too common, apparently. Um, and our word ladder got worse, but why is the word ladder 10 from frame when there's three greens? That is insane. Anyway, uh, probably that means the vowels and consonants had to switch. 
Okay, so flesh, the only green is F. That means L E S H are at least out of place. Um so it does so L is not the green in blade or glove. Um Alright, what what greens am I gonna use though in frame? Okay, what's before L? Uh could we do F A? We might be able to do F A. Well something like far farce. No, it doesn't work. Farm farmy. Ending in Y might make sense. Something like fairy. Oh no, that's not that's not enough points, but what about something like filmy? That's 13 Scrabble score. It doesn't work for frame. It almost works for frame. I'm kind of interested. I, I, at this point, I should be guessing words that could be the answer, but it's tough. Filmy will tell me about alphabet. It'll tell me about Scrabble score. Because at this point, it's either 12 or 13. So this will tell me if I'm going for 12 or 13. Um, it'll tell it if I have like three greens in Filmy, then that's really good to know. Because I'm, I'm wondering whether the Y gets placed here and whether the M was correct from frame. But uh, it's not going to be right. And I don't know if I can afford to do that at this point. What if it was like F E A? So what does this fulfill? We've got so many of these. F E A, we have the green from flesh. Um, that's fine. Um, frame, we have the F and the A. We'd have to do an M, probably, because blade, we'd have the A. What about mouse? What would be our... Yeah, it would make sense for... No, it would. Have, we'd have to end with E. Okay, bl yeah, it doesn't work. Uh, because blade tells us we can't end with E, but then mouse tells us we'd have to end with S or E. But then flesh tells us that we would not have an S in place there. So it can't be F-E-A. Um, what if it was Femme? That's 12 points, that works well. Femme does have three greens in frame. Let's go through it. Blade, one green. Mouse, one green. Glove, one green. Equal just has the yellow E. Frame has three greens. Flesh has one. I think we got it. I think it's Femme. Nice. All right. We managed to not wordle, which is different than don't wordle. You can see I actually have not played this game very much. I guess this was my second game. Interesting. Um, I thought I played more than that, but who knows? Maybe I just watched well, Scott play it a bunch. So yeah, that is definitely a tough word. Um, it's definitely an obscure word. I can see why everything we guessed was too common. And yeah, okay. Well, I didn't really use the word ladder. I don't, I don't think that... Word ladder has never been super helpful for me, but I think in some situations it can be. Really what it was is just alphabet and Scrabble score, trying to maintain those until finally we can just match up all the greens and hope for the best. So yeah, got it in... What is that? Seven guesses? I think that's not terrible for not Wordle. Um, it's a tough game. How'd you do today? Um, ooh, we can show the word ladders. What does that do? Oh, it's thinking. Did I crash it? Um, I might have crashed the site. That's okay. Oh, there we go. Um, wow, okay. So I'm curious about... Okay, I'm curious about frame. Because frame already had three greens. So we had to do frame, brame, blame, blams, beams, berms, germs, germy, jemmy, femmy, fem. That is a tough word ladder. All right, anyway, that's enough of that. Um, Sorry, I got a little I got a little deep in the analysis here. Uh, but if you enjoyed all of this, then why not leave a like and subscribe?